Hello friends, today we are going to learn how to use ADC with STM32 microcontroller. So today we are going to configure ADC as a polling conversion mode. So let us get started step by step. So first of all, we will create a project, go to files and go to new project. This is STM32 project, click over here and it is downloading okay now we will select here board i am using here nucleo board that is stm32 f411 so type here nucleo f411 re and click here and go to next Type here project name. Project name is uh, ADC with polling STM32 and next and finish. Okay. Click over here S. okay so now we will go to analog option and click over here this is adc1 and here select this in0 okay and you can see here it is setting this is 12 bit adc and uh, no need to change this setting so leave this thing and you can see here here the pin is PA0, this is ADC1, so, so our potentiometer will be connected here, okay. Now we will go to clock configuration, so I am using here internal clock because of external oscillator is not connected in my board, so it is selected here, so right now you can see it is 84 megahertz system clock you can see here if you want to change so you can type here 16 megahertz it will be adjust automatically but you can use whatever you want okay it will be adjust automatically so go to project manager here everything is okay and you can go to code generator but no need to change any setting now go to save it will generate the code yes yes okay so first of all we will call adc start function so go to drivers and STM32 HAL drivers go to SRC and that there is uh, STM32 F4XX HAL ADC okay click over here and search start okay yeah there is HAL ADC start function we will call it copy and paste here hmm. okay and here we will have to pass handler adc handler h a d c 1 okay you can see there is yeah this one h a d c 1 copy and you can paste here with n okay semicolon and another function we will call poll for conversion okay so go to hall adc dot c and here search poll okay you can see here adc sorry hall adc for conversion okay copy this and paste here
कॉपी दिस हैंडर ओके एंड हियर टाइम आउट वी विल यूज हॉल टाइम आउट मैक्रो ओके एंड अनदर फंक्शन यू विल गेट वैल्यू ऑफ ए डी सी ओके सो नाउ वी विल सर्च गेट वैल्यू ओके सो दिस फंक्शन विल रिटर्न द वैल्यू ऑफ ए डी सी गेट द कन्वर्टेड वैल्यू फ्रॉम डेटा रजिस्टर ऑफ रेगुलर चैनल ओके I will copy this function. We will have to pass here handler, ADC handler with and operator. Okay. So uh, we will assign this value in a variable. This variable will be ADC value. okay we will have to declare here okay you int 32 underscore t okay now our code is ready so uh here we'll use delay hall underscore delay delay will be 100 millisecond okay so now our code is ready build the code okay hard delay there is something warning one thing uh here we need to type and 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 again save and build the code two errors are there okay this is capital delay okay now again build zero errors with zero warning okay so i will upload the code yeah click on debugger and go to st link and scan the debugger okay now apply and okay waiting for debugger connection okay now it is writing the code okay download verified successfully okay so now we will click on debug we will see the adc count while debugging click on switch now go to live expression okay we will delete here this is previous project uh, variable now go to this variable and add here new expression enter okay so now i will start the debugging click over here resume okay you can see here adc count is uh, showing now i will rotate this potentiometer you can see this adc count will be uh, change according to its rotation okay now this is full uh, rotated potentiometer so voltage uh, sorry adc count is 4095 and this is minimum count it is zero at zero voltage potentiometer output okay okay friends so i hope you enjoyed this video if you really like this video so please do like subscribe and share thanks for watching